What's good YouTube? Welcome to the channel. My name is Dylan and this is my skincare routine. Now I know I don't have the most perfect skin, but I wanted to share with you guys what has been working for me and I think is doing a pretty good job. I've had pretty bad acne since I was in my teens and haven't really been able to tame it until now. After a decade of using a bunch of products on my skin, this has been the routine that has helped me the most. Everyone's skin is different and I'm not a dermatologist, so I definitely recommend hitting up a professional to get a personalized routine. But for reference, my skin tends to be more on the oily side and I add it each step slowly to see how my skin would react after a couple of days. The skincare industry is huge, so there's a lot of products, marketing lingo, and all, a lot of information that just feels super overwhelming. So if I could give myself a piece of advice, the best skincare routine for you is the one that you can stay consistent with. I've tried out so many different products and honestly, they're probably all really good, but I haven't been able to stay consistent with it. So to start off, uh, this is a routine that I do both in the morning and the nighttime. Uh, I'm just a regular dude. I like to keep things simple. I, my number one thing that I start with is a cleanser. So this is the Neutrogena Ultra Gentle Cleanser. Um, I think I've been able to stay consistent with it just because it, it foams a little bit when you make it and that's nice. So I just wet my face. I put in like a little pump of the cleanser and then I rub it in my hands till it foams. And I think this is the part that makes it able for me to keep it as a habit. Cause my skin is usually pretty oily, but this is a nice gentle cleanser. So I just don't feel oily afterwards, but I also don't feel too dry, which I have noticed that with some of the other stuff, if it got too much chemicals in it, my skin doesn't feel good afterwards. Also, another thing is when my skin was that bad, I was banned from using all the white towels. So I definitely recommend getting a black towel if you're leaving your marks on your towels same thing goes with pillowcases uh using a silk pillowcase we grabbed the black one because i was also leaving my mark there too also you gotta make sure you don't pop your pimples because otherwise you get left with these little scars up here and these little pits next up is just i use an exfoliant it's the polish choice bha exfoliant i think with the polish choice it's actually been making my scars lighter um rachel says i do something weird but maybe it helps is that when i do have a pimple that gets popped i kind of just leave it out here i was just hoping that whatever this exfoliant is to get into the pores clear out the dead skin and the bacteria that can cause scarring i don't know how scientifically true that is but it is what i do for the moisturizer that i use i pick something gentle too the moisturizer i've been using is this cetaphil moisturizing lotion it's for your face and body so after a shower i just go through this whole little routine it's not too bad i think that's another thing is why i've been able to stay consistent with this just because it's only been like five minutes for me to actually get through the whole thing and then, then that's your nighttime routine you're pretty much done if it's the daytime you should put on, be putting on sunscreen I just use whatever Rachel uses and the one that we were using, I don't see it. The one that I liked the most was this little glossy thing. It has comes in a yellow bottle, uh, but I don't know where it is right now. So the alternative we've been using is Sunray Translucent Gel Sunscreen with SPS 30. So that's my skincare routine. I'm hoping that this stuff will go down eventually. My main thing is, I guess, just the scarring to see if the scarring will go away. And I think most of my active pimples have gone. There are always the occasional flare up. I've been getting better at not popping the pimples and just letting Paula's Choice do its work. And honestly, that's the game changer. <laughs> you usually see the pimples infl inflammation goes down in a after a couple of days and then it's like it was never there. And then I'm less likely to get scars. Uh, thanks for watching my skincare routine let me know what products you guys are using that has been helping out your acne and or skincare because i'd love to try them out but for now this is what i've been using and i hope it helps you guys out too thanks so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll catch you guys in the next one bye guys